Uh, what's going on people? It's your man the YB back once again. So we got some breaking news for you man who right now regarding Alexander. Very nice, I like him. Very nice. You sick. 100%. He's been arrested. They got some proper military cats on this Donny right now. Look. Anyway, let's play the video. 100%. <laughs> We've got about 20 FSB slash KGB Russian agents in the lip with him. This could really make for a good film script, right? <laughs> <laughs> like they go into the lift. Look, I've never seen so many many men in a lift. You know, we have to count. I have to play the video back here and count. Look, this Donny here, he in the back. He trying to get in too. It's already full. We got this cat who about to step in. I've never seen so many men in a lift before. Yeah, Putin shook at this guy for whatever reason. I think U6 probably this was orchestrated by Putin and FSB. That's what we can confirm. These cats are here are Ukrainian collaborator. Spy agents, come on, people. Yusik is a, a talisman of Ukrainian sovereignty, essentially. Right outside of the Zelensky, it's called a spare spade here. Zelensky, the moody president, take him out, forget about him for a minute. He's, he's somewhere, he's not even in Poland, he's probably in London, to be honest. He's in London grad, okay, that's where Zelensky is. So, Putin ain't never really gonna get him. But Yusik, he out there, he on the streets, he outside as such. So Putin knew this guy could be touched. But like I was saying, it'd be funny if, um, it'd be funny if, like, ten men walk in, and then the elevator opens, and Yusik walks out, and there's the bag of bodies in there. See that one there? Anyway, you've seen the video. Um, at this point, well, initially no one was sure why he was arrested at the airport. Now again, speculators are saying it was the KGB, the FSB dance. Look, some cat put Putin in there. It makes sense to me. Yeah, so AB, it would never happen like that. Like we talked about the other day. Oh, there's always, you know what I mean? I've just started spitting, man. I beg Michelle gets it. Michelle! Oh, wait there a second, people. I'm not going to bother editing this, I can't be asked. You can't get the service these times. How loud does a man need to shout? Do you know what I'm saying? I'm out here trying to put... I wouldn't call it a loaf of bread on the table. I'm, I'm trying to put a few slices of bread on the table, people. Yeah, just a few little... Probably crumbs, actually, if we're honest. Do I be providing crumbs? That's what I'm doing right now, making these videos. Yeah, this ain't charity work. 100% there's a few dons actually who come through and put the YB on with some charity with some charity sponsorships But this right here, I'm trying to put crumbs on the table. Hey, the door's gone. Yeah Get the door People what do you think would happen yet if your granddad was working and he had a doorbell go And she's sitting up there idle Old school not, not happening, right? These are estrogenic beta times, people. Can't even answer the door. Yeah, I'm out here answering the door, doing the washing up. Takes the piss, anyway. <laughs> back to the, um, back to the script for you, man. Where was we? Yeah, he was talking about Usyk and the KGB. The KGB. Not extradition, what do they call it? Ex not expendable. Uh, either way, it was one of them military operations here. Yusuf has gone into the lift. So Yusuf has gone to the airport and he's been intercepted and that was it, extracted by Putin's agents. That's what some people are alleging. Now, I'm only joking. I don't think that's the case. Yeah, and I've got some evidence for that in a second, but listen. In fact, let's give you my name. No, in fact, tell a lie. We'll talk about it now. Secondly, it's possible Tyson Fury and Putin could be working together. 
Yeah, Tyson Fury don't really want to have to box. We people, he got punched up. He was knocked out and was saved by the federal authorities. Do you understand? So I believe Tyson Fury has essentially entered witness protection. Yeah, he is now a cooperating witness. Do you understand? And he came to Putin and said, "Listen, Putin, we've both got a problem here. Yeah, we both have an an enemy, a friend. What was it an enemy of an enemy is a friend? Do you understand?" So Tyson Fury, he prospected Putin and said, listen, bash, we both have a big issue here, man. I can't get the beats of 165 pounds Sean Porter victim again. Yeah. Equally, you can't have you sit just out here promoting the Ukraine situation. That's what you can't have. So Tyson Fury went there with his hat in his hand. Now, I don't know if Putin's zesty or not, but if he was zesty... Tyson Fury blew Putin for the put on. That's the truth, man. Because Putin's got all the infrastructure, right? If Tyson Fury goes to Putin and begs him to extract Usyk and invalidate the rematch, then Putin, he's the one doing all the, all the legwork here. What's Tyson Fury bringing? Some zest. That's what usually happens, people. He ain't got the kind of. Putin's got $100 billion. So if Tyson ain't got the money like that, it's simple, people. Life's simple money or booty. Yeah? Money or booty? Gold or booty? So Tyson ain't got the gold that's gonna pique Putin's interest. Yeah? I'm not saying Putin's zesty, but if he was, and that was the deal they came to, it was one of them for Tyson. And to be fair, Tyson, he's been well-groomed, okay? We know he's in Saudi. We know he's been Turkified. Like all the other men who have be, been flying out there. They've been getting flown out. So it's nothing for Tyson now, is it? He's been well schooled on how to put Massa on. Yeah, he's well schooled in how to satisfy Massa, Massa Turkey, Massa Putin's worldly desires, people. So they, those are the two theories I've got that kind of go to the tales of what's likely. Yeah, either Putin did this extraction himself, or Tyson Fury. I mean. We know Tyson Fury is desperate. He's probably sitting there with Putin, hat in hand, snot dribbling from his nose, just crying his heart out. Oh, don't let me, come on, come on, Vlad. Don't let me go in there with him again. Don't <laughs> let me go in there, man, please, Vlad. I'll do anything. And Vlad was like, Vladimir Putin was like, oh, really? Anything? Zip. Yep, that was it. Oops. Anyway. All jokes aside, that's all bullshit. I ain't gonna lie to you. I just wanted to go on a funny rant. The truth is, it's a whole bunch of nothing. Hate to break it to you. As much as I would have liked to have been a Tyson Fury, sorry, a Putin backed Tyson Fury FSB KGB extraction, it was indeed just a, a mix up, allegedly. Here we go. We're learning more about Alexander Usyk's arrest ahead of Anthony Johnston fight. Give me sport previously reported footage showing Yusik getting arrested and led away by uniformed security officers. A politician in Ukraine confirmed the arrest. The wife of the fighter, Kate, posted on Instagram to allay fears from fans. Everything is fine, she said. Now Ukraine's president, Zelensky, got into the mix. It goes on. In fact, apparently Yusik has also swiftly addressed the incident on his social media accounts. He said the following, Dear friends, a misunderstanding took place. It was quickly resolved, thanks to all who got concerned. Andrzej, some next name, a promoter and boxing insider from Poland, provided more details on Polish website Boxer, saying that Yusik drove from Kiev to Ukraine in Krakow, where the incident took place, he drove, okay, so he could fly to Spain for training ahead of his high stakes heavyweight rematch against Fury, okay, this is Waffle again, apologies, here we go, the reporter added that a companion Usyk was travelling with was denied passage onto the flight for no reason at all, I don't think that's true, if I'm honest, that the guy that Usyk was travelling with, he was probably with the shits, you understand, he was probably one of that. He's probably a goon. He was probably a crash dummy. He probably got like twenty felonious convictions for violent crimes. That's how. Come on, man. I don't think Usyk's not the guy to, to run with like thirty man like Corny Floyd Mayweather. But the ones he will carry with him, 
Yeah, that one goon who Usyk will have in tow, he will be an out and out. He's probably from what's that? What's that place in Russia that blew up a nuclear reaction? He, this is one of them cats, man. Yeah, he'd been living in the woods off the, off the uranium. The moody uranium leaked out. There's buzzing and whatnot. One of them crazy dons. Do you understand, people? So, the article goes on. So he was arrested for no reason at all. This is that people. Zelensky is now on it. Okay. So he, they're gonna now whitewash this. The truth is, Yusik was rolling with a goon. Yeah, he was rolling with someone who stay with it. Do you understand? So he that guy could never without Zelensky stepping in and giving music free passage. That guy's banned from getting on planes. Is the bottom line here? Do you understand? That's why people. Why do you think there was five, five airport officers or whatever else they was getting in the lift with Yusik? Come on, stop playing. You know why? Because they were like, oh shit, this guy's on the most wanted list, right? He's been indicted on 10 capital murders. 10 mafia murders. See, no one's there. That's what they was on. Was, oh, they, was, they were shook. You can see their face. They're like, whoa, this guy, big, big boss. Yeah? And rightfully so, really. Floyd's security guards are corny. Yeah? Floyd gets all the juicy ones that are full of juice but can't fight a lick. Do you understand? You see, got the ones who are really with it. Do you understand? That's why John Fury, even the little one, even the ones who ain't even online, even the ones who ain't even dominant yet, that 15 year old Ukrainian cat, John nutted him and his head was leaking. Yeah, these guys have been living in Chernobyl. Yeah, when you've been living in Usyk, he be training in Chernobyl. And he got some Chernobylian goons out there that he flies in when he's fixing to travel. Because you can't, you touch them there, you nut them on the head and your head starts leaking. They're made of uranium tank. The uranium's. Hardened up their DNA is the bottom line. Anyway, why be you're gassing? Why be there's no way that you six rolling around with uranium goons? Uranium exposed goons. Oops. Peep this here. You sick did not want to fly alone. He refused to board and as a result was detained. Why would you sick not want to board alone? Because he knows. Yeah. I want dude. I don't go nowhere about dude. He with it like that. Floyd, don't, listen. That <laughs> who saw Floyd? Floyd's security guard thought he was tough. Yeah, he was talking about yeah, I do UFC, I do mixed martial arts kind of thing. <laughs> Floyd put him in there. This guy was about two hundred and fifty pounds lean. Yeah, Floyd put him in there. And he got his, he got puns left and right, man. He weren't with it at all. He just wasn't. It was shocking. <laughs> I don't even know what them big guys are good for like that. They ain't gonna have no cardio. They're stiff as well, so I don't. They can't run. I'm not, they're not. Uh, they look big. Obviously, they look imposing, and maybe that's the job because ninety-nine point nine percent of people trying it, the stature will put you off. It will make you think twice. Oh, that's a big nick there. Hmm? Big muscly nick. So that's the that's the, obviously the purpose. But you can not play it, man. Come on, people. You sit could have gone to the airport with some cornball. Yeah, Usyk could have called the money team and flew in one of Usyk's, I mean, one of Mayweather's juicy, useless wrestlers, bodybuilder slash security guards. He could have been done that. No, he wanted a legit one. Yeah, he don't go nowhere without his shooter there. He don't go nowhere without his crash dummy there. To his right. Yeah? So Usyk refused to fly without the dude. And then it goes on. Zelensky, Ukraine's leader, was said he was disappointed at what the country's champion went through. I spoke with Alexander on the phone after he was detained. I was disappointed by this attitude towards our citizen and champion. I instructed the Minister of Foreign Affairs to investigate it. Now everything is fine. Our champion has been released and is no longer being detained. So the bottom line is, people, Zelensky stepped in. But I'm telling you now, airports don't make a big scene. Yeah. Especially in the Ukraine or Poland or wherever it was. They know who... Usyk wouldn't be known in London, yeah. It's a bit like... Maybe even more so because of the political situ situation. But it's like AJ at an airport. Or Usyk at an airport. Usyk at an airport in Poland or Ukraine. I'd argue he's probably bigger. than Because Ukraine don't have no sport like that. They've got a few football guys... Um, but you, you see it's got to be up there with 
I'd put him number one. Maybe I'm biased because I follow boxing, but I'd put him... Come on, people. Undisputed heavyweight champion. Taking out AJ. Taking out Fury. He's got to be their most... I'd probably put him the most known man in Ukraine. Or Poland or whatever. So, them man knew who he was. Yeah. And nine times out of ten, they'd have said, yeah, let's go on then. And after all, it wasn't Yusik who was stopped. The problem was, the guy that Yusik was travelling with had so much... He was so hot, if that makes sense. They couldn't even let Yusik slide. That makes This guy wasn't... The guy that Yusik was travelling with, yeah, who got caught up by the federal authorities tra fixing the travel. Yeah. People... His criminal, what's the word? His violent activity, they couldn't let it slide. This guy's a danger to the public. That's essentially what happened here, right? Otherwise, someone at the hospital, someone at the airport would have said, okay, it's you six guy, we'll let it slide. They couldn't do that. It needed presidential authority to say, okay, man, this guy kill killer, but let him on the flight because he were you sick. Do you understand, people? Do you understand? So that's definitely what happened. Come on now. Equally, I do respect you sick. A lot of, again... If AJ was out with his team and one guy got caught up, AJ would be going on the flight. So I do respect Usyk for, for standing pat and holding solid. Yeah, and I heard in the interview that Usyk gave after being arrested, he, he went straight, no comment. No comment. He ain't, got, he ain't got nothing to say on his compadre. He, don't, he hasn't seen nothing. He don't know nothing. He's never even met dude. He just knows he's travelling with him. That's all he knows. Yeah. In fact, he's not even sure about that. He's not even sure if he's travelling with him or not. Do you understand? So, salute to Yusik. Anyway, people, let me know your thoughts. Smash the like button, subscribe, like up the bell, 100%. No doubt about people, stop it.